Nikola Tesla was a scientist and inventor in the field of electricity. At 12 o'clock a.m. July 10, 1856, <coughs> he is born when a lightning bolt strikes in Croatia. At the age of seven, he fixes his town's new firefighting equipment and is a hero. At age 23, he attends the University of Prague. At age 28, he goes to New York to work for Thomas Edison, but resigns when he is he doesn't get paid as promised. In 1888, the battle of occurrence begins between Thomas Edison and Nikola Tesla and George Westinghouse buys 40 of his patents for one million dollars. And this is an ad in the newspaper for one of the patents that Nikola Tesla sold to George Westinghouse. At age 35, he invented the Tesla coil and became a U.S. citizen. At age 37, using AC generators, the president in Washington, D.C. is able to turn on the lights at the World's Fair in Chicago, many miles away. At the age of 39, using Tesla's AC motor generators, Westinghouse built the first hydroelectric power plant to power the area in Niagara Falls. Also, Nikola does his first experiment in the field of teleautomatics, a remote-controlled boat. In 1899, Tesla moves his lab to Colorado Springs, where he won't disturb people with his high voltage and high frequency experiments. It, and one year later, Tesla creates artificial lightning and hears messages from the universe using radio waves. In 1901, he builds Wardenclyffe Laboratory with the backing of J.P. Morgan. He wants to build a worldwide communication network called Radio City, but unfortunately it fails. Did he? At age 47, after Tesla's Radio City project fails, wanting to be remembered, he shoots lightning up into the sky for 100 miles in all directions. Finally, on January 7, 1943, he dies at the age of 86. And then his major accomplishments, some of his major accomplishments were creating the first the world's first working AC alternating current motor at the age of 28 when its professor said it was impossible. He was able to pick up radio waves more than 20 years before astronomers did. He won the battle against, of the currents against the famous Thomas Edison. Today's power infrastructure relies on Nikola Tesla's AC generators and high power, high voltage transmission, not Edison's DC methods. And he made artificial lightning by using his most powerful Tesla coil, the magnifying transmitter in Colorado Springs, which that's his lab in Colorado Springs. Tesla was awarded over 700 patents worldwide for his discoveries and inventions, including the AC motor, high power transmission, radio and radio controlled devices, electric clocks, turbines, and x-ray equipment and techniques. Some fun facts were that he did not like to write impor important details uh, on paper. He kept all ideas in his head. Tesla's family had always planned for him to be a minister. His mother was also an inventor who developed many household devices. In 1856, years after Tesla's death, the International Commission of Electrical Engineers want on to honors him by naming a unit of measurement for the strength of a magnetic field, the Tesla, abbreviated as T. Tesla's image is on currency and stamps for several in several countries. And these are some examples of the currency, and these are some stamps. This is his impact on Colorado. Nearly all of Nikola Tesla's inventions had an impact on Colorado and the world.
1899, he built his laboratory in Colorado Springs, where he wouldn't disturb as many people. While here, he proved that the Earth was a conductor and made his most powerful Tesla coil, the magnifying transmitter. While he was doing his experiment, artificial lightning, it took up so much power that the Colorado Springs experienced a blackout. And here are just some pictures. Here is his warding, several things, his warding cliff lab. There's a picture of him, his AC motor, some of his patents. And here is one of his patents. And this is, like I said, an ad in a newspaper. This is a modern day test of coil and use. And these were his his exterior and interior of his lab in Colorado Springs. And that's all.